Hey everyone, how's it going? In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a solar eclipse. So I hope you follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our eclipse drawing, I'm going to begin by tracing two circles. So if you don't have anything to trace, that's okay, but I'm just gonna go ahead and use these. So this is my paint palette. I've got a bigger paint palette. I'm gonna center this in the middle of my paper. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna start by tracing this right around here. So I'm just gonna give this a nice little trace all the way across. So I've got a circle. Now, I also have the smaller paint palette. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kinda line this up over here in the corner. Now, like I said, if you don't have any of these, you can just draw these. But I'm gonna go ahead and line this up right on the edge, and I'm going to give this a nice little trace right around here. So I have a big circle, and then now I have a smaller circle in front of it. Now, my big circle is going to be the sun, and my smaller circle is gonna be the moon. So I'm going to begin by working on the moon. So I'm gonna give this kind of like a funny little cute face. So let's begin by making some eyes. So I'm gonna draw a line that's just gonna kind of curve down and then back like this. And then same thing here, I'm gonna draw this line down and then curve it back. So it's kind of like some winky eyes. Next, I'm gonna make a line across and then a line that's going to come down and up. Then I'm gonna make a little curved line for the tongue. And then to make this look more like a moon, I'm gonna add some circles on here to make it look like the little craters. So I'm gonna make some like circles and ovals. They don't even have to be all the way closed up. You can close them all the way up or you can make them kind of open a little bit. So we're just gonna put a couple on here do them kind of right around here. And I'll just do one more small one. I like to do an odd number. Now, over here, I want to make the sun. So I'm gonna make a little face for the sun. So I'm going to make a circle for an eye right up here. Then I'm gonna leave some space and I'm going to make another circle right here. Then I'm gonna make a smaller circle right here at the bottom. And then I'm gonna make another smaller circle right inside of here. And I'm gonna color in the rest of this just to kind of make this look like a little pupil that has a reflection in there. Now I'm gonna give this sun a mouth too. So I'm gonna start by drawing a line here. Then I'm gonna make a line that's gonna come down and up here. I'll make a little sad face for the tongue. Then I'm just gonna make some little curved lines for some teeth up here. Now next, I wanna give my son some little rays on here. So I'm just gonna go and I'm gonna make some nice little triangle shapes all around here. Now, they don't have to all be the same size, but you can definitely do that if you want to. I'm just gonna make just some simple triangle shapes all around here. I'm gonna keep them kinda close to my circle. Then we're just gonna finish it off right there. And then finally, if you want to, you can leave it like this, or you could always go and you can add like some little stars back here if you want to with just like some little circles. But that's to totally up to you. But I'm just gonna go ahead and make some like small circles around here. Just kind of make it look like there are some little stars back here that's going on during my solar eclipse. And there you go, there is your drawing of a sun and moon making a solar eclipse. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed.